We know that the car needs to be clayed because we pulled off a ton of overspray over there on the scratched up quarter panel. So now I'm going to go ahead and clay the rest of the car. If the car is cool to the touch, I'm going to spray down about a half of a panel. And then I'm going to rub until I feel the surface get totally smooth. Now, why only a half a panel? Well, that's because I don't want to let the detail spray dry on the finish before I've had a chance to clay the car. So um, as I clay, I just want to do it just enough for me to be able to definitely address and remove the contaminants without it having a problem of drying. When you're claying your car, you always want to make absolute sure to also clay your glass. Now, whatever contaminated your paint, chances are it also contaminated your glass clay the surfaces more often than the, than, the, than the vertical sections of your car and always, always, always clay your glass. The reason that we have two separate lines of polishes is that we've got one for hand and one for the machine. And I'm going to quickly explain first the machine and then I'm going to skip to the hand. If you want to skip the, the video right now to the hand, please do.